through this conversation, you managed to build with your customers or would be customers, the people that are interested. Um, you're always learning something from them, learning, of course, what interests them and what concerns them and what kind of uh, needs they have. Um, and was there ever any, 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 any time where you, you thought you understood your customers because of your previous experiences and then through this process you actually realized that your understanding was not complete or well, might have been mistaken? It, well, I think I always had a pretty good handle on uh, what, the, uh, what the customer was thinking about the immigration experience. But I think what really sealed the deal for me was when uh, at the end of 2000 I relocated my young family, as I say, from Hong Kong to Western Australia. And then I put myself and I put my family down this immigration journey themselves that took us 12 years to travel. And, you know, we had a, a, a visa status that was only good for four years initially. It was temporary, it was going to end, and there was a possibility of a two-year extension if you played your cards right. So for the first three years, I really didn't do that much with the business. And so the last year, like most immigration applicants do, they start doing something about their status. So, so I had the sword of Damocles hanging over me for that last year, and then I was able to sort of get through that problem and get myself a two-year extension, which kind of delayed the, the next application subsequently. So I went through this process with my entire family, understanding what it feels like. You know, mm. so because I understand what it feels like, I can inject that into the business model. Mm. So I'm looking at it both from the, the years of experience, but also from the personal experience. You mm. know, what does it feel like and what are people expecting at this juncture? And what can I do to deliver exactly what it is that they need at this juncture so that they're getting value that means something to them? That is something that I can reasonably deliver and still, you know, make make decent money out of it, so that I can continue to to deliver the free value to most people anyway. Yeah. <laughs>